We've got uh, Dr. Benita Rumanzi. Dr. Benita Rumanzi has been with us since the beginning of the year and he's going to be going back to Uganda on uh, Saturday. And he's amazing. I love this guy. He has the joy of the Lord. He, an African, with his own money, started a, a, an institute that is now going to be going into a full-fledged university. And he's building a, a high school in a place called Kavari. Hallelujah. I was so encouraged by the vision he has, things he's doing, and, and the love he has for Jesus above all, and became my brother. You know, a lot of us, they say, no, blood is thicker than water. So I'm sticking to blood, which is good. But there is what is thicker than blood. It is the spirit. Because flesh and blood will never inherit the kingdom of God. But the spirit. So whoever is born again brother, he is your brother for all eternity. In Jesus' name. Come brother and say hello to us. He has his book. He wrote a book. I don't know if you yeah, give it to me. Um, he wrote a book. You know, Africans... I want us to encourage each other to be writers. Yes, our forefathers did their part. I'm not here to critique them. They did oral story and all this oral story. If we don't write, I don't want to be in your line. I'm going to be a writer. You got to be a writer. And so uh, he wrote a book. It's called Beating the Odds, the Unlimited Key to Success. Hallelujah. And it's 10 bucks. And before he goes to Uganda, we're going to put it on Amazon in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Uh, and he has, uh, he's the director of Africa Population Institute, uh, which you believe soon shall be Africa Population University. In it shall be APU. Hallelujah. So this is the book. And it's 10 bucks. It's even less than Starbucks coffee plus uh, muffins. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Thank you very much, Pastor. I am humbled to be in this place. Oh my God, when I came here to Washington, D.C., which is the capital of the world, yeah, because I believe America is the superpower, therefore being in their capital, you are in the capital of the world. So we shall not be limited. Yes, we are beating the odds. When I told people that I'm going to launch this book in Washington, D.C., Oh, they thought that I was crazy. They thought that I had cut off the wires. But I told them when I was launching it in Kabale. Hallelujah. So I'm glad that the dream came to pass. Thank you very much, Pastor Mutangana. You are really a brother. You have encouraged me for the many days I have been around. And Pastor Nko, thank you very much for being a mother in this place. You have literally transformed my life. And also, Brother Rogers, oh my God, we have traversed United States of America. We have moved to different states, and wherever we have gone, we have been welcome. Yesterday, we were in Hagerstown, and we met a family. And we found that someone was my cousin, but we didn't know him also. So I'm telling you, God is a good God. But Pastor, you've just encouraged that, that blood is not just thicker than water, but the spirit of the Lord is thicker than water, than the blood itself. But the blood of Jesus, which washes away all the sins, that takes away the sins of the world, is more sufficient. So when I came in, right now I'm looking at the fact that I am going to, to New York. We talked with Rogers when we were driving, coming here. We're like, can you imagine in that vocabulary that today we are going to be in New York? This is the thing we started in geography, and we are like, New York, Manhattan, you will never reach there. But God, in his infinite wisdom, he has accepted that today we are in Washington, D.C., and by closure of the day, we shall be in New York. Glory to God. Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Thank you very amen, much. Amen, amen. God bless you to you, Tremble. In Jesus' name. Thank you, Dr. Romanzi. Hallelujah. For those watching us, if you're in Uganda and you really want to, to, to get to school, uh, ask Brother Roger on the chat where the institute is and you can be a part of it in Jesus' name. 
Hallelujah. It's high time Africa, man. We do companies. We do, they, they, they start to say Africa is rising. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name. To God be the glory.